Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Guys, today I am going to show you how to get rid of this annoyance right here. You guys may have seen this um, after, um, you may have seen it after a recent update because I think a Windows, a recent Windows update uh, kind of enables this. So if you're using the Windows Spotlight desktop background theme, uh, you might have noticed this also. Um, and I think a recent update turns that on for some reason, because this just happened to mine for no reason. I've never messed with that stuff. So you guys might, um, you guys might recognize this thing. You might all of a sudden have this and it's driving you nuts. So you can actually click on this. Like if you double click this, it will open it and tell you about the picture, which for some people might be, that might be a pretty cool option. Um, I think it's a cool option. But I don't like having this here. Uh, if you right click on it, it does the same thing, open it. So there's no delete option or anything like that. So it drives me nuts. So I'm going to show you a way to get rid of this with a simple registry hack. So you're just going to go down to your start and you're going to type reg edit for registry editor. And that will bring up your editor here. And let's see where we're at. So we're going to need to go to H key current user which is where we are, and then software, and then all the way down here to Microsoft, and then all the way down to Windows. And don't worry, I'm gonna put this down in the description as well, so you can just kinda of copy it. You copy it from the description and paste it up here, you'll be good to go. Um, so after Windows, we're going to current version, and then Explorer. Oh, this is a long one, and then high desktop icons. And then this new start panel here. So when you get to this new start panel, I'm just going to have you right click on that. And at that point, we're going to go here to new. And then we're going to do a new D word 32 bit value. Um, off screen here, I have what you need to name this thing. So I'm going to go ahead and copy that. And then I'll just paste that into here. Again, all that information is down in the description. Once you paste that in there, hit enter. And once that is in place, you can either right click and go to modify or just double click. And then you're going to change the value data to one. And that turns that icon off. So you hit OK. And then we're just going to minimize this here. You see it's still there, but we just need to refresh our desktop. So you can either hit F5 on your keyboard or you can right click and click refresh. And as you can see, it goes away. Now, if you want it back, you can either delete this whole thing here, uh, just right click and hit delete, or you can double click and then just change that uh, to zero and then do the same thing. Uh, once you uh, minimize, after you change that to zero, uh, you'll refresh and it will come back. I'm not gonna do that because I want it gone, but it's as easy as that, guys. It drove me nuts until I figured that out. So I really hope that helps you out. If it did, click that like button and really, really, really think about subscribing if you want to see future content and tips and tricks like this. Thanks, guys.